what is good we're back got a little adp discussion for you we got some new adp out from dlf so we like to cruise over the top 50 or so and check that out see if there was any big movement if we see any value but just mostly to keep kind of a pulse on on what's going on out there uh, important to see you know where the public is and, and who's moving around and, and all that jazz so we like to uh, try to do this once a month Jay Wayne, how you doing over there? Doing fantastic. And we're uh, we're gonna get super flex involved here after the draft, but we've only ever done one QB on this, so we're gonna try to do both from here on out. But let's both jump right in, super flex and and regular. Not tonight. Not tonight. But after the draft. All yeah. right. So one more what thing. Do you the reason why this is so important, right, is because you might like a guy better than another guy. But knowing the ADP, knowing where the value actually lands, will help you to not have to reach too far. Right. And this is where it you get into the tiers, and it's like, oh, if I have this guy in the same tier as all these other guys, and they're all on the board, maybe I can trade back a little bit and pick up some capital. Right. right. So this is just just keeping your pulse capital on the industry. Draft capital. Drink. John Bauer. Shout out. I'm only on the waters, but I'll drink for the two. I'm drinking for two. I'm <laughs> beer it. pregnant. Love it. All right, so we're just going to try to run through kind of round by round, but mostly going to stay inside the top 50 and just move right through. So Jonathan Taylor, Jamar Chase, Jefferson, and Najee Harris are the top four. None of that really changes, right? Stayed the same for March, which we didn't do. Well, actually, we did a March draft, right? We did. Are we part of this ADP? I don't know if it was March or if we were part of April. Maybe we're part of this one. I can't remember. We'll say we're part of this one. I know Kenny Walker moved on up. I know we helped that out. but Let's I'm not go. Well, we actually, yeah, go check that out. We did a draft, and, and we actually jumped in one of these mocks, and now we're influencing Influence. the ADP. Yeah. Okay, so top four didn't change. The Javante jumps up from 11 to 5. Javante Knew that was up. coming. Got I a mean, video out. Is he a top five wide receiver? or, or, or uh, Running back. Running back. Not, yep. we didn't, it wasn't startup pick. Jesus, this is too high for Javante Williams over there. Um, I'm, I'm okay with it. I would probably take Swift over him, but, I mean, I just we we got to clear up a little bit more of a situation and make sure there's not going to be another running back in the way of Javante for that because if there is then Melvin, I'll take Swift. As of recording of this, Melvin hasn't signed with the Ravens and it almost feels like he might be using that as a way to get a little bit more money out of the Broncos. And if they brought him back, it would just crush everyone's dreams. It certainly would. But it this ADP would. is planning for him to be out. If he's out, I'm fine with it. Like yeah. it really doesn't matter to me. I divide. Swift, Javante, uh, Najee, all I'm I'm cool with any of those dudes. Uh, Pitts, non tight end premium, up at six. Yeah, probably gotta drop him down a little bit if it's Schmidge. if it's not tight end premium. All he's going into is with Marcus Mariota. That's not the best. Yeah, and then we got C D. He's all he's pretty much staying the same. How is C D's value holding on A D Z? This is that's respect right there because yeah. I don't see him getting that type of respect no, out in the real of, world. Definitely a lot of shit being talked and some hate being thrown on C D's name. So I think you said something before we started that if there is any um disrespect, there'll be a value on C D right. Lamb, but that's there's no value right Not there. Not showing it there. But Swift doesn't mean that there couldn't be somebody in your league who's one of those haters. Swift is next. Swift or Javon, uh, uh, Swift, CD. I'd rather have give me Swift. Okay. Um, like I said, I, I Swift's pretty interchangeable up there with those other guys, and so I would drop CD down uh, a little bit here. Then AJ Brown, pretty much kind of staying the same. Cooper Cup, probably staying the same. Not for me there. Not um, for me. Pass. D Debo that, there. It's hot. It's hot. It's, hot. it's hard to take a twenty nine wide receiver in the first round. Debo's but climbing. Antonio Brown was kind of. In that same Cooper Cup mold where he was still a really tied oh, yeah. pick at, yeah, at yeah, age yeah, yeah. 28, 29. So it's kind of in that. And and, and, and I, I think it's safe to say that the Cup isn't going to go crazy. So. Yeah. I've, fair. But. I don't hate it. You're taking a running back on a two to three year deal to help you win a league. Cooper Cup can help you win a league. Yeah, but you're not taking another, deal. those guys, those two or three year running backs until a little further down. Fair. All right. Um, there he is, CMC. There's Debo, and he's he's come up four spots, which, you know, if he's not a Niner, it probably kills the value a good bit right. for me. That's pretty recent news. And I'm so still that, not buying at that value there. So It's, it's a lot. Probably wasn't buying at 15, but. It's a lot. Yeah. Let me get, let me, yeah, I got to get a few more players. And then CMC there, like, I'm down with that. I'd take him over Debo and Cup for sure, probably 
Maybe even AJ over cup. G- give me cup, but no, give me CMC for sure. I think that's when CMC's high on the CMC, field. CMC, he's but. he's the best in the game, and I it, I think he's getting back on track, and we're going to be just fine. Just had a, a bummer of of a year and a half, two years here. All right, you want to move into the second round? Yeah, let's get it. Eckler coming up a little bit, huh? Up from seventeen to thirteen. Yeah, he shot up there. That's probably a little rich for my blood. Why the jump? I don't know. Just nothing happened. All the Chargers, if you, as that'll be a trend throughout this whole thing. All the Chargers jumped up in ADP. I don't know if it's because their situation stayed exactly the same. You know, they don't have like a better wide receiver than Mike Williams in there. The, the draft hasn't happened. They didn't bring in any running backs. Right. See, I don't know why, but they're all they're all creeping up. Which I get it. You know, it's a safe offense. Chargers buzz, baby. Yeah. All right. Uh, Brees is up here. He's he's like we said. We've talked about this multiple times. Big when we jump. talked about Brees and in, in the winner there post we combine, knock him right on the door of the first round, and and probably gonna get into that first round for sure before the summer is over here. Um, so he jumped up a couple spots there, four maybe. Um, Coming on up, yeah. We didn't. Seventeen uh, is a jump up from what it seven even was spots before for that Bre- for Brees, and then Waddle he drops down a little bit. We've we've have a we've done a waddle. Yeah, Brees was forty three in February, February. yeah, and so all the way up to twenty one, and then fourteen. Fourteen, and we called it. We told you. Gotcha. Not uh, that it helped you because you you're smart and you didn't have your rookie draft already. So, waddle at fifteen, still in. Properly rated, waddle over Devonte. Uh, Even yeah. with Tyreek, I think I got to take waddle over. Yeah, waddle over Devonte. Waddle. Yeah, well, I mean, I feel like we did that whole Dolphins episode. Maybe I'll throw a card up. We didn't uh, We didn't really move Waddle that much. No. It is kind of a bummer. Devontae didn't move all that much. He moved only two in this, and, and in that Troy King thing, I feel like we all probably dropped him maybe down a little bit more. Yeah, I mean, even, T. But. Higgins or Devontae Adams, I got to take T. We, I didn't even ask that question again to, to Troy because I was like, it's too easy. Right. He, right? Was, he, was, he had... He moved. To, he moved. Diggs we were above already, him. We started a few guys below T when we right. started. Right. I was working my way up to T, but I didn't get <laughs> there because it was no Devonte. Um, and then DK, he falls a couple picks. Still holding strong, but though. it seems like it's pointing to maybe DK Metcalf's out of there, and I, maybe I would Ow. be trying to buy any sort of dip right now. I I possibly could. I like that. Worst yeah. case scenario, I end up with DK Metcalf. Right. <laughs> Best that's case, a, sen- that's best a case fantastic scenario. worst case scenario. <laughs> but he's a he's a superhuman guy, and I got him. Uh, but then if he if he lands he's and gets traded somewhere, souping over, you know. Yeah, for sure, for sure. <laughs> um, Saquon, then he's up a good a couple of spots. I like that. I'm I'm, I'm I like I've stated multiple times. I'm taking one more trip around the sun with Saquon. I you know usually I try to go against what the haters are hating on, but I almost I just I'm scared, man. I just I don't feel, it doesn't feel safe it doesn't feel great taking Saquon especially if he's going if he's just coming up he's love coming it. up love it that's hot man second round Saquon second round Saquon that's where he should be baby let's go I don't know man let's I, go. I, I, give me Mixon you know let me give get me the Saquon. sure thing give Mixon's me value just got better the whole situation got better and he's already really good and they're fairly the same age so let me get yeah. Mixon we we'll got Mixon coming up here I know. shortly I'm we'll get- jumping ahead. Mark Andrews staying about the same. He's the second tight end off the board nowadays. Uh, Tyreek. Hot. It's big, hot for non tight end premium. Big drop for, for Tyreek. I mean, Andrews uh, a lot of volume. Um, but non tight end yeah. premium, man, it's too, too, too hot. It's too early. Tyreek all the way down to 21. That's probably, you know, properly rated. You said you would take Tyreek over, over Devontae, though. So yeah. You'd probably swap Devontae and Tyreek for you. Or yeah. Probably me, too. Yeah. For sure. Um, Josh Allen, the quarterbacks all came up in this draft. They get, they found a bunch of quarterback friendly get guys. Get rid of them. Yeah. <laughs> At this high, yeah, second round quarterback in a one QB league. Can't do it, man. Yeah. You just can't do it. You're handicapping yourself. Diggs stays put after being paid, which, you know, if you feel good about Diggs right now. Mixon, like you said, right there he is. If, if you wanted to jump, jump him up a couple of spots. Um, I, I wouldn't be upset about that situation. Just got better. He's he's good. If he stays healthy, he's he's going to produce for you at a pretty high level. Uh, he will be 26, and there is only two years on his deal that that that, that, that are that are you know significant. Yeah. So you're on kind of a two year deal. Well, now, so you're now down we're into, into the, now we're into into the that area round. that you were talking about earlier. Okay, just not number nine yeah. overall. We're at 24 now. Okay, 
Fair. Yeah. Well, then we got Dalvin here. Move to the third round. Yep. Dalvin, Dalvin Cook. That's too hot. How's so he moving much, up? So much upside how do you, with that pick. Uh, how do you move up from 27 to 25? You know, how's Dalvin Cook's value increasing over the offseason? No news. No, no news. Not a news. peep. Not, right. a, not so a peep. Maybe, maybe you're good. And if you're good, I mean, I'm fine with taking Dalvin there. But um, who knows? Gibson uh, is right up. He's moving up a couple spots. Henry is, is steadily moved up this entire uh, off season of doing this, he's all the way up to twenty four. I'm probably that doesn't take feel a, great. I think man. I got to take a couple other guys before I take Derrick Henry. Let me there. get Nick Chubb. Yeah, I'd be fine with Kamara and DJ Moore and Deontay. Um, so yeah, but all those all, all these guys pretty much stay the same. Deontay falls a little bit. Uh, Dobbins pretty much stays the same. Although with the recency news, the recent news, I don't know that. I mean, I guess if if Dobbins is already behind Gibson and, you know, Chubb and Mixon, then I guess I'm fine with that. Yeah. Right above E.T., you know, not E.T. or, or, or Dobbins. With the, if, if Melvin Gordon signs with the Ravens, do you want Dobbins or E.T.? Give me, give me E.T. Yeah. Yeah. But, you know, that's about as far as I can move down. Uh, uh, J.K. or 1-2? 1-2. Uh, so like Kenneth Walker, yeah. basically, we're penciling in Kenneth Walker at the one two in one QB rookie drafts, and we're gonna beat that motherfucking drum <laughs> all goddamn off season because it's, it's easy. It's so easy to beat that drum, and nobody's really doing it. And I'm fucking loving it. I'm Gotta. fucking loving it. That's our man, and we're fucking planting flags. We've been planting flags. <laughs> Check out the Kenneth Walker uh, profile video. We were all enamored, and people just want – they can't get over the target share, man. They just can't do it. He can't catch balls. There's no way he could be any good. Give me, the, Give me Kenneth, the Walker. Kenneth Walker. Let me get Kenneth yeah. Walker. All right. What else? Um, Godwin at 34, up two spots. That's fine. Mahomes. <sighs> you want to take Mahomes right here? I think I got to take a few more players before I take the best quarterback I mean, in the league. I'm probably – there's a real – Strong possibility that I'm not taking a quarterback inside the top 50. Yeah. No, definitely not. And and and, and Mahomes, why am I, what am I saying? Mahomes just lost Tyreek. Who knows what that's even going to fucking look like. Yeah. The wheels are, already fell off with Tyreek. They put him back on. But it's certainly not going to get any better right. over there. Right. Yeah, Dobbins not that far away from E.T. right now. E.T.'s up to 37. Now he was just the next running back I yeah. saw. And then Kenny, Kenny which ET's sticks. coming up, baby. ET's coming up. Kenneth Walker's coming up properly, just like they should. Pittman, you know he's he's got a good chance. Big to jump get a, with Matty Ice up from fifty to thirty nine. I mean, yeah, it's, you got a slightly more competent and and probably more willing to be a little bit more pass happy than than Wentz was, and Pittman's just going to get a decent amount of target share and opportunity and i think he's just a pretty skilled target, player so target gonna, share. that's a new word drink target if you're gonna share. give him that then i think he'll be just fine so sure keenan has just just stays crushing the chargers yeah. all these chargers moving up 52 right to 40 to that's a 12 that's a whole round herbert jump went up, up 58 to 41 herbert the charger charger right there boom boom i know i don't understand the meteoric well it's not meteoric but it you know shooting star rise i don't yeah. i don't i don't quite understand it whatever must have been a bunch of Chargers fans in these ADP drafts. Looks like we got our first rookie wide receiver. We haven't had Burks, right? Mm -mm, nope. Garrett Wilson, first off the board, staying right where he was at 42, which I believe. Scary Terry's dropping a couple picks with, with the uh, Carson Wentz edition. Yeah, it's like it, it couldn't get any worse, but it didn't get that much better. Yeah, so I mean, it's probably the best he's had. I'm okay with it. Fair. I don't love it, though. We Wentz? Yeah, they could still draft a guy, I guess. But it, yeah. 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 we got Kelsey. <laughs> Kelsey making an appearance. Um, dropping 49. You know, now he's he been can... steadily dropping. But then Tyreek, you know, leaving yeah. certainly doesn't make me feel better about Kelsey. I guess I don't know. Does yeah, it? I don't. I, I guess I'm I okay with, with Kelsey, Kelsey there. If he's 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 gonna win you weeks. Kelsey or one three. Weeks, so, uh, one three. Okay. So give me Traylon Burks, All especially right. non-tight end premium. Right. So Traylon's Traylon actually uh, dropped dropped uh, twelve or eleven spots. Bad yep, combine, had, had so 40. had to drop him around. Nobody likes him. Get rid of him. <laughs> now, but at forty five, that's still respect though. Uh, that's well, respect yes. on a bad combine for plenty sure. of respect. Yeah. Jacobs dropped seven picks. 
Um, Skipping right over which, Mike Evans like everybody else does. That's that's a <laughs> strong observation. Um, you know, Jacobs perennially disrespected, but it was RB8 and RB12 two out of the last three seasons. And the only season he wasn't was his rookie season. It's like... As long as they plays, don't draft like good. Kyron Williams or something, right. you know, it'll be fantastic. They did bring over Bolden, and Bolden's a good player, but, you know, right, I think showed that he could receive the ball. Feel pretty good about Jacobs there. Still only 24. Kittle, yeah. Kittle or Jacobs? I guess you got to go Jacobs. Um, it's not yeah. tight end premium. Right, it's not tight end premium. Lenny, whoo! Big jump. That's a bit rich for Lenny. For Uncle me. Lenny up from seventy. Playoff Lenny. To I like 49. seventy Lenny. I don't love forty nine Lenny. You don't love forty nine Lenny. Uh uh-uh. uh. Amari or Lenny? Because you're about to get like a potential RB one for like one to two years. Yeah. In the fifty spot, you were just doing that with Mixon. Yeah. Well, twenty four spot. I think I might go Amari. This is more. This is more longevity. It's a, probably a better dynasty play. Yeah. I'm hoping to get Lenny from somebody's team who's not tired good. of him. Yeah. But how could you be tired of him if you have oh, Lenny? No, you no, know he's no. good. I I like Lenny. I mean, I I traded him away at the end of the season on a team that I wasn't competing on, and and got a first round pick and some other stuff. But you know, now he's you know. That's did that not, guy win the league? No. Okay, good. He did not. Um, Devonta Smith. St. Brown. We're going deeper into the top 50. If you guys hung around, we're going to maybe get 60 I for your to pleasure. Some bonus time. I wanted to get to these uh, Bronco receivers. Yeah, uh, I, TJ, I did too. I did too. That's why I went to 60. TJ Hawkinson, 53. I mean, he's he's getting a, a little bit down into where he could potentially be That's a huge a value, value. For sure. Um, I mean, to get that guy, to get TJ Hawkinson, super young, tight end stud. People are getting a little tired. Jesus, man. People have just no... It's just a Let's grab bad, that mat and catch that beautiful butterfly. There's no long-term memory. The short-term memory is bad. The recency bias is excessive. And just people are just the worst, man. Yeah. I, I just hate people. Um, <laughs> Jerry Judy makes an appearance here fifty down from 51 to 54. So not so much love on Judy, but it's probably about properly rated here. We're getting close to the top 50. London, Amon Ra or Judy? London, if you wanted to... Um, that's a toss up. I don't really know. I don't have a great answer for that right now. It's pro- probably you probably should take Judy. You should probably take Judy, but Judy, you're one four. Judy's never Judy one five. Judy's never shown what St. Brown show. That's true. That's true. But yeah, but. St. Brown has league winning upside. Fuck. But I do. I do like Judy. London. London. You could Judy you or could, one five. That's uh, where London's going. I guess Shit, I London take, might go I, even higher. But you know, I would take Drake probably. Drake over London, huh? Drake over. We don't know the Judy. capital. We don't know the landing spot. Yeah, I mean that's taking that's, Drake, huh? That's, that's Based a good, on the profile, this is a good spot for all these guys. So I, I feel I feel okay about really any of them. Um, Aaron Jones. Aaron Jones. I guess so. Montgomery taking a one to two sure. year deal. Oh, steal on Montgomery. That's Montgomery. a value. I don't know why he dropped. From forty six to fifty seven, there's no reason he should drop eleven spots out of nowhere. Don't you gonna give me an another round of value on Montgomery? Fuck yeah, that's fucking fantastic. I wouldn't mind seeing Zeke be in my RB two. You playing zero RB? You get Zeke as your RB one or two. Man, yeah, I, I listened to that. some show they were fucking crushing Zeke, and it was like you know he was hurt. He was yeah. RB six, and he was banging the fuck up. Yeah, well, he wore that crazy, that bulky ass brace for. Big yeah, stretch of the season. like he no was, one wants to give him good. any fucking credit for that. He looked pretty he good. He played the, through it in the beginning. He just of the looked season. like trash. He, he looks like trash. <laughs> I'm so cool because I say trash. <laughs> get the fuck out of here with the word trash. That's I why I know you're not cool. I don't mind the word trash. I, I hate it. It's just overused. With the trash. It's just overused, and everyone thinks they sound cool saying trash. I just that was that was a shout out to Troy King. I think we had him on the show. He didn't say trash one fucking time. He's not. He's not, that was fantastic. Shout out to Troy King. No trash. Um, and then Juju rounds out the top 60 here, and he gets all the way up from 94. So that's a pretty big jump. It's a big one. But It's a big one. I'm down with it. I can dig it. I think Juju's going to be just fine. Juju or 110. That's in the lava. Jameis Williams, George Pickens. If I could get Jameis and Williams, I might take a shot there, but uh, or Pickens. But 
Other, other than, than that, that I would if, take Juju. if Pickens and Jameson are gone, you take Juju over Olave and yeah. Sky Moore and probably over Sky Moore. Yeah, I'm trying to think who else is in that. But tier maybe with. maybe you should take Sky Moore. Dotson, Bell. Dotson Bell. Yeah. Let me get Juju. Yeah, I'd probably take. Still Juju only like too. 25, 26 years old. Yeah, he's in the twenty five. He'll only be twenty five. I think, you, I think Ju- Juju owners might be stoked to get that for the return. For because they've been holding, and now they got. A big they, this is your cell window, but why not just ride it out? See how it goes. You know? We are gambling here. Sure. This is this is gambling. So take Sky Moore and call it a day. Yeah. <laughs> hey, some people got him mocked to the first round. Sky Moore goes in the fucking first round of the NFL draft. Why fire him up? Let's go, baby. Because they never get it wrong in the NFL draft. <laughs> not since I've been watching. The fucking 50% hit rate in the first round. So let's just all settle down about draft capital, maybe a little bit. Shout out to Elijah Mitchell. You didn't even say his name. He he had no draft capital up here at 58. Boom. That's that's about where you should take it. I think I did say his name, but it was just briefly, really quickly. Mm, I didn't hear it. We'll go back. We'll check the tape. All right. Well, appreciate you guys for joining us, man. This is our quickest ADP review ever. Hopefully for your pleasure. Got through a lot. And uh, let me get that five star review. If you, I don't know if we, do we ever put these out on the podcast. Would you want to put that out on the podcast? We said the the, yeah, the order the that could go out. Sure, that could go out. Throw it out there. Yeah, first ADP review on the podcast. There you go. Let me get that five star <laughs> review on Spotify and iTunes. Just hit the five stars. And if you're on YouTube, definitely let me get that subscription. Appreciate y'all. We'll be back later for your pleasure. Peace.